nights in a month. It's time for bed, but tomorrow we can put the Christmas tree up, okay? How cool is that gonna be, buddy? Yeah, I remember last year we did that. Uh-huh. Yeah, you were like, what daddy doing? He was kind of scared, but it'll be fun, I think. Yeah. All right. Night, night. It's been raining for hours, huh, buddy? It's been raining for hours. Uh-huh. And that frustrates you, because you think I can turn the rain off, but I can't. No, so you have to stay inside. Mm-hmm. I gotta take a shower, buddy. And then we'll do playtime and tire you out. Because you're probably full of energy, huh? And then I'm gonna put the Christmas tree up. Yeah. I'm gonna put the Christmas tree up, okay? I'm sure he'll love it. Yeah. All right, buddy. I gotta hop in the shower, okay? You be a good boy while I'm in the shower. You gonna behave yourself? You gonna behave yourself, my friend? Okay, good. You already got wet food. <laughs> Let me walk you up that. Oh, six or so, yeah. And then before that, at four, he just he wanted to go outside, but it was too rainy. Okay, buddy, gotta take a shower, okay? Mm. Yeah, I got the shower. Cinnamon actually wanted out. Believe it or not, I didn't think he'd want. I was showing him how wet it was. Come here, buddy. Cinnamon, come here. He just even in this kind of weather, he just loves going outside. So we'll get our morning started and we'll wait for Cinnamon's return. <laughs> He'll probably be very happy to come back. Regardless of what he's doing now, which who knows. I told you that was a bad idea, buddy. I told you, look how wet you are. Oh no, oh no. A little wet grub. I told you that was dangerous, buddy. Oh, you are soaking wet, kitty. Let's towel you off, okay? I'll grab a towel. I know you hate that, but I need to what? I need to dry you off quicker, okay? Yeah. Where'd you go, buddy? Where'd you go? You little Titanic refugee here. Oh, 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 okay. He's scared of the towel. I'm just trying to dry you off, buddy. Yeah. Okay, you dry off naturally then, okay? Air dry. Get the hair dryer. That would really freak him out, huh? <laughs> we won't do that, buddy. But what we will do, we'll get the Christmas tree out, okay? You gonna help me put the Christmas tree up? I'm sure he'll be afraid of it. You come out of there, buddy. <laughs> Look what we got in the mail. We ordered some stuff. Yeah. She ordered some stuff from my brother for Christmas. And Apex Gun Parts gave me an ornament. Check it out, buddy. Happy holidays from Apex Gun Parts. A special gift for you. Look. It has an elephant on there, too. Never forget. Don't hunt elephants. Oh, unless we're trying to get you. Ooh, 2020. There's a bottom of an AK. Specifically, the trigger guard and magazine release assembly. Yeah, let's go ahead and open this up, buddy, okay? We'll go ahead and open this up and we'll show it to you. Yeah. Ooh, buddy, look, I opened it up now. Look, see? Look, the other side has an elephant with an AK, too. Yeah. Check it out. Oh, look, look. We'll put it on the tree, okay? We'll put it on the tree. Uh-huh. Well, good boy, you still what? Okay, let's go and put the tree up, okay? Ready? Ready, spaghetti? Okay. We're going to put it right there. Just like last year. Right in front of the poster representing one of the best films of all time. Star Wars Episode Three: Revenge of the Sith. Back when Star Wars was really good, now it's just good. He's gonna be afraid. I think last year when I brought it's all coming back. When I brought the totes up, he got scared. So, well, and some of the totes are rather large, which you will see. Cinnabon, come here, buddy. I think he knows I'm up to something. Got the stockings. This is mine, of course. Yeah. And then, most importantly of all, <gasps> we got Cinnabon stocking. Oh, look at how cool that is. Cinnabon, come here, buddy. Look at what your grandma made this for you, remember? You, you, you know something's going on, don't you? Yeah. Ooh. This will probably end up being a really long video. That's okay, though. Check it out, buddy. Yeah, check it out. Remember, your grandma made that for you. Remember? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I got to bring up a couple large metal containers that once housed 120 millimeter mortars, I think. Yeah. He's not going to like that, no. Big Booma, huh? We'll go ahead and hang these on our movie racks. Yeah. Put yours right front and center, okay? That's nice. We'll have to fill that with some stocking stuffers, huh? That one's mine, huh? Isn't that cool? Yeah. Inspecting the box. We'll put this one on the other side, okay? Yeah. 
Cover up all those pornos, huh? <laughs> Just teasing. <laughs> you sound like a dog sometimes. What are you barking? All right, I got to bring up the big scary containers now, okay? You'll be okay with that, my friend? You can inspect those as well. He ain't going to like that. He's going to freak when I bring those up here. Yeah, I know. Get ready, buddy. Get ready. He's up there somewhere. Here's the first one. Christmas tree one. I label a lot of stuff, huh? Look how big this is. He's going to freak. Make way for the big container. You're not going to like this. Once he notices what I have in my head. Hey, buddy, look. Watch out. Oh, he's doing better this time. Got one more to go, okay? Try not to hit the wall with this bad boy. Oh, it's big. When I take the lids off, you might freak. I got one more, buddy. One more big one, okay? Then I'm done for now. Yeah. And put the tree together. This is a, it's a process, yeah. Uh-huh. Last one. I remember I bought these back when I lived in my parents' house. They're like $10 each shipped. How do they even do that? I had to wash out a really fine sand, too. Yeah. Watch out. Oh, oh. yeah, that's what I expected. Well, he went through one of them without doing that, so that's good. Yeah. All right. Now we just got to unbox everything. Will you come down and help us, buddy? Oh, please. We need help. Well, I can hear the rain really coming down. Oh, my goodness. It's just a pouring out there, isn't it? Yeah. Cinnamon's probably hiding at this point, but we have the fake tree parts. The other stuff we got to put on there. So, always had a fake tree, even growing up. I think it's the best overall, because they don't have to have a fire hazard. And it's environmentally friendly, although people say, you know what it cost to make this tree? It killed six villages, you know? Okay, whatever. Where'd Cinnabon go? Same with the leather, fake leather couch. People are like, is that real leather? Like, no. <laughs> and they're like, well, even if it's fake, there's a huge environmental impact. To which I say, I do have a real leather jacket. <laughs> oh, well. Damned if you do, damned if you don't, huh, buddy? It's cold out there and rainy. You don't want to go out there, buddy. You don't want to go out there. No. No. Why don't we distract you from how bad the weather is by giving you some treats, huh? we get some treats for you, okay? Oh, he knows what that means. We'll go ahead and bust some treats out for you. Ready, spaghetti? Come on, come on. Okay, mister. Oh. In about two hours, we have your... Well, you've already seen it, but the one and a half hour Q&A, so we'll have to break for that, because I'm sure I won't be able to get all this done in two hours. Or maybe we will. We don't want to cut it close. Look, there's some crumbs down there, but look. Here, I'll feed you the crumb. Ooh. There's another one. Even the fake trees make a mess. They always lose a little bristle, so we gotta vacuum after. Yeah. We need a vacuum anyway, so it works out well. Yeah. Ooh. Well, a crunchy one, huh? Here's another. Oh, what a good boy. Okay. I'm gonna get the tree started down there. Okay, you can help me if you want to. You can help me. We're just gonna assemble the basically the basic tree and twist all the bristles to make it look full. Yeah. And the very last thing, I'm going to have to get some presents. I have some presents, but they're not wrapped yet. So that'll probably be in a later video. Yeah. Or you'll just see it. We got the bottom one done. You got to straighten out all the bristles, too, because they get bent. Of course, in storage. Cinnamon's been crying upstairs for a while. It's okay, buddy. He does this any rainy day because he really, really wants to go outside. You hear that rain, buddy? It's coming out pretty good. Why don't you come downstairs and check on what your daddy's doing, okay? Come on. Yeah, check out the tree you're putting up. He's probably like something's going on because it looks kind of like a tree. It's in progress. They sure don't grow like this. He's pretty good about not messing with the tree. A lot of people have said, does he mess with the Christmas tree? No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. You want to see? Want to look at it? Isn't that cool, buddy? So we've got the blue ones in. The next color is green. So we find all the green bristles. You can pretty much do this without any instruction because it's so intuitive. Yeah. Look, buddy. This is the branch. See, look. Yeah. Got the next layer done. We got blue and, and green done. Cinnamon's having a pity party over there, kind of crying. Want to do a little playtime, buddy? <laughs> okay. 
All right, he's like, you're not paying attention to me, Daddy. I can't go inside, and I'm not sleeping. Okay, so I have to play with you then. Okay, we'll do a little play time to kind of hopefully tire you out, and then you can sleep while I put the tree up. Okay, here we go. So this video is going to be very long, if you haven't already. It's probably already long at this point. Ooh, that's okay, though. Need to burn his energy. I don't know what he's, he's outside for like two hours this morning, so I don't know what he was doing out there, if anything. What were you doing out there, buddy? Were you actually doing something or just trying to hide from the rain, which you could have probably avoided by staying inside? <laughs> Whoa. After I get all the tree limbs put on the tree, it's like a reverse of cutting a tree almost. Yeah, a real one anyway. I will probably put the lights on. Mm-hmm. And then the garland, I think call it garland. And no, by the way, Cinnamon doesn't eat that. Everyone's like, your cat's gonna die, he's gonna eat that. Like, he doesn't eat that stuff. He's not, he's not dumb, he knows what not to eat. Yeah, same with the day lilies. Every time I show those when they're in season or whatever, people freak out. But the whole neighborhood ha has those, and the whole neighborhood has cats, and it's not a problem. They must just know not to do that. It's just a, a cat thing. We, we humans wouldn't understand it, no. Yeah. He's not like a human kid, he doesn't, doesn't eat everything. In fact, it doesn't even like human food. I can actually have most food by itself with him having access to it, and he won't do it. The most, if anything, he'll like sniff it, maybe look at once and be like, nope. I don't like it. Oh no, it got away from me. I got away. It is Saturday, so you'll see this next Saturday, which will be today for you. So I like to do extra longer videos on Saturday too, because there's a lot more time to edit them and all that good stuff. Where'd the cinema go? Where'd you go? And I gotta keep on checking the time too. I don't wanna run into the premiere and leave y'all hanging. Cause I'm gonna watch it with you. Yeah, and talk to y'all in the comments in that video. Yeah. In the Q and A video, not this one. A lot of people ask for a live video with Cinnabon. That's very difficult to do because his schedule and mine's fairly sporadic and my internet's terrible. There would be a lot of lag. It would not be, it would be a disaster. So the best I can do for now anyway is a pre-recorded premiere. Mm. Well, where'd Cinnabon go? Is he gonna stay under the steps here? Whoa, no, I guess not. There's a monster under these steps. There's a monster under there. Oh, did this tie into a knot? Yeah, I did. I'm gonna, I'll fix it. I'll fix it, okay? All as well in the world, in the basement. It's all unknotted, buddy. Whoa! There's his hand. Oh, no, he's got a firm grip on it. Whoa. No, it's attacking the rail. Okay, buddy, I gotta get back to the tree, okay? You'll be a good kitty. <laughs> oh, he'll he's taking care. Oh my goodness, oh no. That poor toy didn't even see it coming. All right, buddy, I gotta get back to work, okay? Whoa! Be a good boy, okay? You gonna behave on yourself down here, huh? You gonna behave yourself? I hope so. Whoa! Little rocket ship kitty, huh? He's gonna wanna go outside or get some food. One of the two. One of those ain't gonna happen. <laughs> well, I'm not gonna let you out there, buddy. It's raining out there. Whoa. Okay, back to the tree. I can hear it from here coming down. Starting to take form. Just have to put the crown on there. So right now you could say it's a Christmas bush. I hear Cinnabon up there. He's still crying a little bit. A little pouty. Come here, buddy. Come on. Come down here. Where'd you go? You might have went to one of the guest rooms. Oh, no, there he is. He's just peeping around the corner. Hmm. Very hesitant, aren't you? He's like, I don't know. I don't know what's going on down here. I don't know what's going on with this tree. Check it out, buddy. Yeah, it's not not ready yet. Yeah. Just gotta put this one on. Yeah, check it out. Don't wanna scare you. I'm gonna put it on top, okay? Ooh. Now I just gotta kinda bend it into shape. Isn't that cool, buddy? Just kinda bend these out. Get it to look a little bit nicer. Yeah. There's a city near me that has a tower. It looks kinda bad, but I guess they tried, but it's it's painfully obvious it's not a real tree. I don't 
have a picture of it on my phone or anything like that. Otherwise, it'd show you. It's like a cell phone tower or something that they disguised as a pine tree to make it look a little bit nicer, but it, it looks pretty bad. <laughs> At least they tried, right? They also have a castle in the same city, so what do you expect? Cinnabon's very chirpy today, aren't you, buddy? Hey, look at that mess I got a vacuum. Look at that, look at that mess down there, buddy. Look at that mess. I know you'll get really mad when it's raining outside and I won't let you out, okay? Just about done with the pine tree as far as getting the the frame of it set up or whatever. Doesn't that look nice, buddy? Probably different than the ones you're used to, huh? And the next step is gonna be putting the lights around it. Yeah. Uh-huh. He's like, I'm done. I'm out of here. I'm done. See ya. Ready? Three, two, boom. Cinnamon, come here, buddy. We got the tree lights on there. Yeah. He's upstairs. He's like, what do I do? Come here, Cinnabon. We got the tree already. Yeah. Sort of. Rearrange the lights a little bit. They're heavy in some spots. Get that sorted out. Then we'll start putting the other stuff on there, okay? Yeah. Pretty dang decent looking tree. Just gotta make it a little more consistent. Yeah. Cinnabon, do you want to look at it? Come on, come here. Okay. Have it your way. Cinnamon is enjoying the show from afar, aren't you, buddy? <laughs> we'll a little peep out of him. Got this on, the garland or whatever the heck it's called, the poison. The next, the, probably one of the most time-consuming parts, is putting on all the ornaments we got. Yeah. Well, the tree has all the balls on it now. Now we're going to start putting the actual ornaments on. Cinnamon's still upstairs, kind of afraid of it. We'll see if we can get him down there later, huh? Oh, not even looking at me. I see how it is. He's looking outside. I can hear the rain coming. I'll show you as well. Yeah, a little hard to tell from here. The star was in my family for at least a few generations. And that's it for now. I'll put the little skirt thing under there after I vacuum because I made a big mess. But that looks pretty darn good, I must say. And of course, we have to put presents on there. One unusual thing about the tree people notice is that there's a gap on the bottom. And that's how the tree always was. And my opinion of that is so we can put big gifts under there. One of Cinnabon's presents is going to be a little bigger than normal. Yeah. Okay, where'd Cinnabon go? Is he in the snow? He's not in his chair? Is he? He's probably next to the door. No. Oh, hi. You getting your breakfast, buddy? Okay. Do you want to see the tree that I did? Huh? Do you want to see the tree downstairs, buddy? I won't vacuum it yet because, well, he freaks out with the vacuum. What a pretty shot. We got Cinnabon and the Christmas tree in the background. Yeah. Do you want to go down there and check it out with me, buddy? Come on, let's go down there. We have time. We have about 50 minutes before the premiere. Come on, buddy. Let's go downstairs. <laughs> okay, we'll see. We'll see what it takes Daddy to get Cinnabon downstairs, huh? Come here, buddy. Come here. Oh, ooh, look what I found. Oh, I found nothing. But I'll pretend I did. Quick a ball for one of my exes. Look at buddy. Look at this one. Oh, come here. All right, I guess we'll have to do this later. <laughs> I have enough time before the premiere to make a very nice meal. Boiling the chicken before frying it up a little bit. Also having some vegetables. So chicken and vegetables. It's very, very low in carbs, huh, buddy? That's a healthy meal for your daddy. Yeah. For seasoning the chicken, I use a little bit of onion powder, garlic powder, a little salt, pepper. 
And of course, I got this from Freddy's yesterday. Yeah, some extra barbecue sauce. So that kind of makes it less healthy, but hey, whatever. Of course, we have the Christmas kitty calendar. Yeah, a lot of Christmas theme going on. Of course, most of you have seen the lovely Christmas mask that I have. Cinnabon's on there twice, see? How cool is that? Yeah. Yeah, a fan of the channel made that for me. Isn't that nice? Yeah. Okay. Cinnabon's wondering, what is daddy doing, huh? Well, he's daddy cooking. Yeah. He probably wants out again, even though it's raining. You won't like it, buddy. No, you won't like it over there. No, it's wet and cold. Things you don't really prefer, do you? No. We'll just let him look, though. That's okay. Look, I see his little tail. <laughs> Some things must be intriguing him. He's probably a little upset with me. That I won't, that I won't, that daddy won't turn the rain off. No, I can't. Look how nice the tree looks when it's dark down there. Yeah. Well, better get back to the stovetop. Can't leave it unattended for too long, no? Tonight, I'm probably gonna go to Meyer do most of my final, if not the rest of my Christmas shopping for Cinnabon and my family. So I'm not gonna really show any of that because, because that would spoil the surprise, right? So I won't be filming that. Yeah, plus this video, I'm sure, is long enough. I have no idea at this point how long it is. But that's just how it is sometimes. It is. I'm watching cat TV while there's birds out there. Oh, yeah. We gotta stay inside so we can't get them yet. <laughs> I'm sorry. There you have it. A nice, healthy meal. Gotta eat your veggies, huh, buddy? Uh-huh. It's raining outside, buddy. I'll show you for yourself if you don't believe me. Hopefully he doesn't jump out, we'll see. Yeah, buddy, this is crummy. You don't want this, no. You're a jet. See, it's it's garbage out there, buddy. I've got to close the door, okay? Watch your head, buddy. No, 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 no. Oh, you want to try to go out? Oh, he's going to regret that. Ooh, okay. All right, buddy. Well, you come back as soon as you can, okay? Because it's nasty out here. This is the last of my chicken, by the way. So next, you'll probably be seeing me cooking some steak which is good, but I am gonna pick up some more chicken. Probably tonight and steak. Keep in the freezer so I have a good supply. And it's good stuff, it tastes good too, and it's healthy. So I'm still outside, he'll probably be out there for a while. But anywho, this is the one, another reason why I can never do a live premiere. He sometimes wants to go outside, sometimes he doesn't. But I almost forgot, I got the candy canes, gotta put the candy canes in the tree, so I'll do that real quick. <laughs> Most fun part. There we go, that looks much better. Hey buddy, I got treats. That's one way I can get you to see the tree. Come on, let's go see the tree. Let's turn on the lights down there. Oh no, no, can the blender switch? There it is. Oh, come on, buddy, come on. What you looking at? Oh, I just look at the garbage by the door. Okay, come on. Look at how cool the tree is, buddy. Do you like it? I did it for you. Yeah? Do you think it's cool, huh? Isn't it neat? Yeah? Oh, he's checking it out. See how long it is before he tears the thing down. Maybe he can help take it down. That'd be more appropriate, yeah. Okay, here we go. We'll do a quick little treat time. We got two left. I already gave him one off camera. Oh, here you go, mister. Yeah. Here's one more. Yeah, Christmas tree. Treat time. Haha. <laughs> treat, treat time. <laughs> Say that five times fast, huh? Yeah. We'll have to get some presents under there soon. Yeah, we'll see those in future videos, I'm sure. Uh -huh. Well, thank you everybody so much for joining us today. And we wish you have a fantastic Saturday. Bye-bye. That's all the treats I got right now, buddy. That's all the treats I got for now. I'm all out. I got nothing on me. Yeah. Nope, nothing at all. Except for clothes. Unlike you, mister. Yeah. All right. Thanks again, everybody. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye. You just don't want to say bye. You don't want this video to end, do you? That's okay. I'm sure some people don't either. <laughs> but I do. So with that, peace out, everybody. Bye-bye, everyone. Thanks for watching.